so good morning to all today we discuss about uh, from the topic then liquid drop model and semi empirical mass formula from nuclear physics okay so already we have to discuss uh, what are the things that should be nuclear property then binding energy then nuclear force and some of the problems already we have to discuss in the previous classes okay liquid drop model so then liquid drop model the liquid drop model was proposed by George Gaumau most important so this is the first point and second point the atomic nucleus the atomic nucleus like drop of incompressible that is most important word incompressible nuclear fuel so it explain it explain now which one that should be liquid drop model explain many bulk properties bulk properties of nuclei so this is the most important point introduction about the liquid drop model so first point then liquid drop model was proposed by who is proposed there should be a direct question then second one then liquid drop model we have to take it as a then drop of incompressible nuclear fuel okay then third then liquid drop model explain many bulk properties of nuclei okay so some of the assumption we already discussed from the nuclear uh, forces then what are the assumption so what is the first assumption the nucleon nucleons are held together by short range nuclear force the notice meant by a second the nuclear force is saturating then third this is the most important the nucleus behaves like a liquid drop with surface tension so there are very important point only we have to compress and uh, you have to given in that presentation okay so these are all the some of the most important point we have to know about while studying the liquid drop model okay so from that liquid drop model then semi empirical mass formula formula semi empirical mass formula then how to write then binding energy which is equal to then a1 a minus then a2 then a2 by 3 minus a3 then z square by a1 by 3 minus a4 a minus 2z whole square by a plus pairing up here a1 to the volume energy 
then a2 ன்றது surface energy a3 ன்றது coulomb energy this is all the constant then a4 ன்றது asymmetric energy then a5 or that is called pairing energy okay kandipa uh, semi empirical mass form and definitely may be sometimes ask problems also okay apo then then a1 is their volume energy apo volume energy it proportional to the total nuclear that should be a a then surface energy then surface energy is the less bound so it is most important less bound then coulomb energy is the electrostatic repulsion between proton then asymmetric energy is the neutron proton imbalance then pairing energy depends on there should be a proton and neutron there should be nuclear pairing sometimes there should be asked in direct question so in the binding energy which we have to find out uh, binding energy then uh, most of the cases we have to use this formula suppose sometimes uh, volume energy surface energy kudutite binding energy kekalam so appo uh, volume energy surface energy kuduthuvanga just we have to substitute in that formula then after that we have to multiply with a and finally we have to Uh, substitute in this equation we have to get binding energy so already we have to put some of the problems in binding energy so same way we have to follow in this cases okay good so then uh, liquid drop model and semi empirical mass formula and some of the mcq we have to discuss okay so uh, already i have to said that So, निगे M C Q बनाने में तो इन्ना पनी कीनो और note paper ऐड देखिए just to way out to uh, write it question number one then correct option way out to mention that then way out to conclude that then out of out to you have to score okay then after that way out to comment your answer in the comment section okay then first question then liquid drop model treats the nucleus as the volume term in semi empirical mass formula accounts for then surface energy term in semi empirical mass formula is ellame namba and we have to given one equation so and the equation konja ninga namba varichitingna idellame easy eludidalam okay so ad related ah one mcq we have to prepare that similarly the coulomb term in semi empirical mass formula accounts for and question number 5 then which nucleus is predicated to be the most stable by semi empirical mass formula and question number 6 the asymmetric term in semi empirical mass formula became zero when question number 7 then pairing energy is maximum for question number 8 the term responsible for decreasing stability in heavy nuclei so question number 9 which semi empirical mass formula term is proportional to a 2 by 3 so the binding energy so the binding energy per nucleon of a stable nucleus is approximately which one is right so idik ellathukume detail ana answer with explanation nammaloda app la irukke nanbargale so most of the students there may be a more than 35 students are already joined in that answer key batch and also uh, daily test batches also then we have to provide so much of the batches then we have to go and find out the website and uh, google play stores okay so like ellathukana answer key vande we have to upload it daily in answer key batches okay if you have any doubt about regarding this you have to contact through whatsapp or you have to comment in the comment section okay thank you